everyone, it's Jenny and we're going to read this um, book again, Minute, Minute Treasury. It's by Disney and Pixar mis mixed together and I've already read for you <coughs> Finding Dory, an unfortunate a forgettable family. Now we're going to read The Good Dinosaur Along Journey Home. A long time ago, there, two, there lived two dinosaurs called Henry and Ida. They live on the farm next to Clatooth Mountain. They have three children, Buck, Library, and Allo. Allo has was the youngest. From the moment he hatched, he was afraid of everything. Most of all, Allo was afraid of the whiteness beyond his family farm. One day, a chicho broke into the farm. <clears throat> broke into the farm and ate some corn. Allo went with his pop papa to look for the chicho, but there was a terrific <laughs> Terrifying. Terrifying storm. And Henry, Henry was swept away with a flooded river. Flooded with river. Allo was <coughs> devastated. 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 He would never see his papa again. With papa a gone, gone, the family had to work very hard to keep the fun going. Alo's mom, mama, was worn out. Alo helped out by carrying the corn on his back. One day, Arlo cut the cutter, stealing corn again, as he and the cutter fought. But <clears throat> they tripled backwards into the river. Mama, Mama, Arlo cried. Would, <clears throat> would he had been swept to farm away from a any more to hear the river carrying Arlo away. Then, bam, the little dinosaur hit his head on a rock. And he was pulled under his courage. His courage. When Arlo woke up, he had no idea where he was. The whiteness, the whiteness, news was all around him. After a while, the current appeared. It was a human boy. At first, Hello was angry with the boy. He, this is all your fault, he shouted. But the boy <clears throat> brought him berries to eat. And they became friends. Arlo gave the boy a name, Spot. Spot could talk. So he drew a picture in the dirt to communicate Arlo. Communicate. Arlo learned that. Just as he was lost, his papa, Spot, 
has lost his whole family. The, the friends look up at the moon and let out sad holes to go. <coughs> the next day, Alo and Spot met a family of T. T-Rex called Butch, Ramsay, and Nest. They had lots, lots. They have had lots of, lots. Their head of long horn, long horns, long horns, horns. The long horns are known. Allo, afraid, afraid to help the T-Rex. In return, he asked them if they could show him the way home to Cartoof Mountain. The T Rex ang angered. So Spot, Spot, sniff, 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 out at the long horns of them. <coughs> But the nasty, <clears throat> nasty, but the a nasty surprise. surprise lay in wait. Raptors, his gang of feathers, feathers, feather, feathery. Dinosaur jumped up, bucks back, biting him. At first, Arlo was frightened. Frightened, frightened, and didn't know how to help. But his friend Spot, who was sitting on his back, un undid him, nudged, un nudged him. Allowed, <clears throat> charged, 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 straight at the raptor head, put <clears throat> putting it out of the way. He had. Done it. That night, after all, Arlo spot their <clears throat> their their new friend had chased the raptor away. They had around a campfire. You, you, and that critter, critter showed. Real good grit today, but told <coughs> Arlo, Arlo, the three T Rex told stories about the adventure, including including times when they had fought of of the beasts, even crocodiles. I'm done being scared, Arlo said. Who said? I'm not scared," said the. Who had said I'm not scared? Said the. Allo and. <coughs> Allo has Worse. was surprised, but you thought of that car. Listen, kid. Book continues. You can't get rid of get fear. Get rid of get. Get rid of fear. But you can get through it. <coughs> you can find out <coughs> what you are made of. The next day, the T Rex <coughs> kept their promise to Ar Arlo. They showed him the way to the river that would lead them to. Spot home. The boy and the dinosaur were on their way again. They played the laugh, laugh, and they played and laughed together as they ran along. Soon, Spot clambered to the top of Arlo's head. <coughs> as they climbed up the Tallest hill, hill, Arlo lifted his head up through the clouds. He said, 
Wow, he said. They could be Cartoof Mountain. They were heading home. The next day, the river trail moved into the mountain. Thunder rumbled overhead. The wind blew strongly, and it began to rain. Suddenly, a pack of Peter Rod Jackley's tills stooped down and on of the crouch hole a spot. No, Arlo yelled, trying to grab the boy back. But the <clears throat> Peter Rod till spot crashed in was too strong. With one last tug, the creature took the to the sky with spot crash in in its claw. Spot, Arlo cried, as his little friend as appeared disappeared disappeared. Arlo chased the <coughs> pewter rodentils down into the river. As the storm raged on, he bravely <coughs> he bravely charged charged as the creatures and finally rescued rescued Spot. Suddenly, the river burst his back. Arlo and Spot were were swept swept swept. Away, away by the good salt water, and they were heading towards the waterfall. The little dinosaur swam with all his strength. He managed to reach Spot just before they tumbled over the edge. The two friends clung to each other as they feel. feel Into the waterfall, far below. Splash! They landed into the wa- river at the bottom of the waterfall. It's harsh. Exhausted. 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 Arlo climbed onto the la- onto onto land. He was still holding. Holding his little friend, Arlo and Spot looked at each other and smiled. They were feeling shocked and but bruised. And bruises, 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 bruises. But they were okay. The next morning, the storm has passed. Arlo and Spot set off once more. Along the river trail, after a while, they saw something strung up ahead. A human family. Spot ran over to them, as Arlo watched the family <coughs> gather around Spot. They knew that he had to do, to do. He had to let Spot go. It would be better for Spot to live with a family of humans. The two friends cried as, as they said goodbye. The for well, the last part of his journey. 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 The journey. Jour, journey. 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 Arlo <coughs> cried on a lot. Finally, the farm came into view. Arlo, cr- Arlo cried, "Mama!" as the spotted her son. Mama, as she spotted her son, Buck and Libra came running towards <clears throat> towards them, and the family laughed and hugged. <clears throat> Arlo w- was home at last. Next, I'll read.
read inside out. Looking after the relay. Okay, that's all for today. Bye. Bye.